Hello and welcome back to Sherwood Park Toyota. Today we're looking at a Infiniti QX50 sensory model in the color blue. Let's take a look. Up front underneath the hood here we have the turbocharged 2 liter 4 cylinder engine automatic transmission. Gets up to 268 horsepower, 280 pound foot of torque. Up front you have LED headlights, customary daytime running lights, and fog lights down below. Across your front bumper you'll find these little inset round nodules. These are your front parking sensors. And then up front here on the grill, right above the logo, you'll also find your front camera. As you move along to the side here, we have the black alloy wheels. Side mirrors have integrated turn signals and additional cameras underneath to contribute to the surround view camera effect. We do have these little buttons on all of your handles. We'll talk about that more on the front driver's door. All of your rear windows come with factory tinting and up top we have silver roof rails. As we approach the back here, across your rear bumper, we have the backup parking sensors. You have your all-wheel drive badge to the left. On the right, you have your QX50 trim level badge. And then underneath your rear logos is your backup camera. This is also where you go to release the hatch. Simply reach under and press the button, and it will automatically pop open. Inside here, you'll find you have a 60-40 split on the right-hand side. This allows your seats to fold down either both at once or either side by itself in order to extend your cargo space forward. This can be accomplished by releasing the little handles on either side with the coordinating seat that you're trying to get down. In the back here we also have your cargo cover stretched across the back. This extends fully outwards here across these little tracks and then locks into place in these little grooves. This helps to keep private anything that you have stored in your rear space from any prying eyes. Back here, you'll also find your Infinity branded rubber mat lining. This is much easier to remove and to clean any dirt or debris off of versus that typical carpeted interior lining. It also helps to protect the vehicle from any damage from your cargo and protect your cargo from damages from the vehicle. You'll also find back here your QX50 QX50 Infinity carpeted mats in their factory packaging. Left hand side you have a 12 volt adapter. Right hand side you have your interior lighting and if you're looking for your spare tire kit simply look down underneath the mat. You'll find this little handle. Lift that up and everything you need will be stored underneath and be accessible through this space which can be used as additional storage as well. To close up your space here you can reach up to the handle on the right hand side or on the left you have the electronic button. You can simply close or you can close and lock. Next, let's take a look at the inside. Inside here, your interior lining is a combo of the leatherette and suede. The suede is a bit more prominent on your front seats, but they also come with some white stitching for contrast and a bit of texturing on your seats. In the back here, rear passengers have access to the folding down armrest slash cup holder, easily folds away to increase your seating space. Up top, everybody also has a great view of the overhead panoramic moonroof. On the back of your front passenger and front driver's seats, there is pouch storage available. Back of your console, you have your air vents, chargers, as well as having three variant levels for your heated seats and a little cubby space now below. Currently, we have the rubber infinity mats throughout the unit. Inside your door here, we have more of the black leatherette and the black suede, as well as having the metallic highlights and this wood grain trim you'll find throughout. Now we have our first look at the Bose sound system. Now back to the little buttons on the handles. This indicates keyless entry, so if you're trying to get into any one of the four doors, simply press this little button and it will unlock the unit for you. Inside here, power windows for front and back. You have your window lock, power lock system, and side mirror controls, including the ability to fold your mirrors in flat with the body of your vehicle. Up top here is your memory seat settings, which of course means electronic seat adjustment, back front, up, down, and your lumbar support. Hood release latch on the bottom left-hand side of your dash. Above that, you have all of your controls for your headlamps, your uh, dash brightness controls, steering controls, parking sensors, your intelligence, and then your power trunk release. Front, up front here on your steering column, we also have the power adjustable tilt and telescopic controls. And then up top, you'll also find your trip reset for your odometer. Taking a look at your steering wheel here, 
left hand side is your controls for your display here. You then have all of your volume control and hands-free communication. Right hand side here is controls for your dash display. Then you have your full sensors display here for your unit and then all of your adaptive cruise control settings. We also have your paddle shifters up top here. And then if you look upwards, you'll find this little cutout on your dash. If you look right across here, you will notice the odometer is displayed on your windshield. This is a really nice built-in feature to have. That way you don't have to take your eyes off the road to keep an eye on your most pertinent of information. Then in the middle here, we have the dual screens for your infotainment. Up top here is primarily for your navigation. And then down below is everything else. So you have your phone info connectivity, your driver's assistance, and then your in-touch services, infinity quick guide settings, and your infinity intuition. And then this is all of your customization for the navigation up top here. Everything is fully touch sensitive. We also have your display for the climate as well, which happens to be dual. That way you and your front passenger can have your own unique temperature settings or you can sync them up as they are right now. We also have your, your front heated and cooled seats for either side, three variant levels for all. And in terms of audio, we have AM, FM, and satellite radio, full Bluetooth connectivity, as well as USB adapters. The frost for your front and rear windshield are on the right hand side. On the bottom is everything for your CD player as well as having your volume control. Then all the way underneath here is your storage space. This is a wireless charging pad. It is compatible with all wireless charging devices. Next to that is all of your charger and adapters. You have your cup holders, push start ignition, your gear shift and then driving modes, parking brakes, and then all of your driving options including the trigger for your surround view cameras. Give that a press and you're now able to see everything around you. Press it one more time and it'll change which direction you're looking from, and then you can simply go back to your regular navigation menus. Just back from there is where you have your console pops open, and then you have this up top storage space and additional chargers inside here as well. Up overhead on your rear view mirror, one, two, and three dots, those are your garage door openers. You then have your sunglasses compartment, SOS button, overhead lighting controls, and the controls for your panoramic moonroof. Thanks again, folks, for coming with us on this full video tour for this Infinity QX50 sensory model in the color blue. It is located here at Sherwood Park Toyota at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta. You can also reach us at 780-306-7703. And remember, life is full of choices. Let us be yours.